Alright, this is my next tutorial. Have you ever had that urge that you wanted to correct an angular axis? An angular axis? Because basically in trials, you would make like, like angular axes, like on the angular axis scale. So let's say if I wanted to make a house roof, I go to the Empire of the Sky. Usually when I make my Walking Dead maps, I usually like to make a lot of roofs with uh, p uh, pyramidical shapes, right? So if I wanted to make a house roof, I just turn them. You see how the axes are screwed up here? It's really screwed up. Like I wanted to make a house roof, but then how do you turn them? You know what I mean? Without screwing up the axes, you know, as they're screwed up like this. So I'm going to make it an easy uh, house roof here. Be exactly perfect. Just a tutorial, I usually spend more time aligning it. I'm going to be rotating on the E the green axes right now. I'm going to make a little house roof. I think it's straight for now. Alright, and now I'm going to go over to the common section. Or the, yeah, the common section. I'm going to go over the physics tool and there's a, an object glue tool. You see right here, the object glue tool. Which is a very useful tool for other parameters in track building. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select my event targets by holding LB, let it go, press up its uh, properties menu. Then I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to say glue object. Normally since it's a small object it will turn on physics on. We want them off. Visibility obviously does what it does. Now your your axes are are fixed. Now you can rotate the object like it was before, you see? my nice roof I made. Now that's how you correct angular axes.